All right, everybody. Uh, been a couple of weeks, and it's New Year's, and holidays are over, and I'm back to record a, another installment of Surviving Tutorial. Now, we discovered we had bears, and I killed a bear, and then another bear showed up like they were mates or something well i got rid of the bear got rid of some wolves and i'm not going to talk about how i did that uh this is a tutorial done told y'all it's a tutorial there are certain things i have hidden away that take care of some of these things and let's just say this is not a safe area but before we can move i need to upgrade a copper pickaxe and to upgrade the copper pickaxe, I need to go up here and make me, get me some tin so I can make some tin bronze. Now, it's almost dark and I've got to travel a little ways. So, I'm going to travel. I need to take me a little more dirt than I've got. Because I'm going to have to make me a little hidey way hut. Let's get back to first person. And where is my dirt? That's terra That's something else. There's dirt. Let's put the medium fertility away. Let's take a stack of low fertility soil. And that. And oh yeah, I forgot to put my firewood back up oh, the fire i need to replenish my stack of firewood uh yeah killed the bear got more meat uh made me some red meat, red meat stew i've got about half of serving there all right we need to get going make enough distance oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a second hold on a second we want to take our bed with us because we're gonna want to sleep okay and here are the wolves yeah the wolves piggy's still up uh, he's dead because i guess apparently the bear killed the pig well she's gonna lay there i'm not she's gonna stay right where she's at it's a calf okay all right what's that keep us some berries keep that bush take that bush that bush Black current, black current, black current. Birch leaves. Okay, give me that black current bush and that black current bush. That one, and I know that one's blooming, but I'll take it anyway. Okay, I've got some other current bushes and everything, and that's just, you know, a good practice. Find current bushes, pick them up. Blueberry, black current. Red current, white current, doesn't matter. Just pick them up. It's a good little traveling snack. Look at all, th what is up with this? I'll have more than I can possibly ever eat. There's also other things you can do with it in this game. Really? All right, I think we've got a bunch. Okay, where are we at? Close. Okay, gotta keep heading this direction. 
There's where we cleared out some clay. But we're not going to start mining until daytime. And here we are. We're here. Looks like there's a cave system here. Look at our uh, gear. Looks good. Okay. Now we build our little hut. Little dirt hut. Home away from home. Well, didn't mean to put it there, but okay, we are putting it there. That's where the game decided to put it. You know what, horse? You are really getting on my nerves. Go. Oh, just stand there, huh? Get out of my little house. Sorry, but I, I, I'm, I'm pressed for time here. I don't like being cramped. Okay, that was for a reason. Don't like feeling cramped in my little hut. Put the bed down. You can put the torch up, but holding it in my hand, it just, the durability doesn't go down. You stick it on the wall, it'll burn out. So I keep it in my hand. Now, we put it in our other hand and do that it's pitch black I mean now if you really need to throw it up there do some things whatever I'm not going to pretty it up uh, I'm going to eat a few berries crap uh, never mind yes. And as I thought we would have, we've got groaners and moaners. And see, torch is there. Put it in our hands. Uh, take our bed. Yeah, we've got the groaner guys. Yeah. He's running away. Okay. That's good. I got one over there. It looks like he's uh, picked a fight with a cow. He's going to lose that fight. Right, he's over there. Let's jump down. Let's go. Okay, I know there's more tin around here somewhere. Gotta be. That's water. Told you there's more tin around here. It's very spotty. Let's do something else. Got an idea. 
idea. Uh, just not that idea. Oh, oh. Uh, he fell, and that's exactly what we wanted him to do, was fall. This is kind of a cheap way to uh, sort of platform your way down to where you want to mine. That's lead. Crap. I want tin ore, not lead. Well, that sucks. get but two pieces of ore over here. I could have swore this was like what the heck was that all about? Oh well that's just wonderful. That was close. Uh yeah. That was very close. That could have been bad. Like, majorly bad. Fill that in with some dirt. Yeah, that's a, that's a place that you stand on a place like that too long and you go with the sand or gravel and you're in a cave. Cave in, basically. There is an area that's showing light on this other side. And I don't want to wade through water. figure out where that light's coming from. And looks like I'm going to have to an angry guy in here. He don't like me being in his dark place. So he told you. I don't feel like getting decimated by the drifter. Lead. It's just not enough tin. Ow. Well, I did that myself. Well, okay. Found an entrance to another cave. And a gear. How about that? Do, do, do. Taking a risk. Well, doesn't look like any drifters are going to make it out of this cave. It's literally a straight down drop. Not going to go down there. Now, how am I going to get out? I'm going this way. I see the berries. I 
I've got a ton of berries and berry bushes. Yeah, I got 10. Are those black, red, red? Yeah, I don't need, I don't need that many. There's resin. Oh my gosh, I've got so much resin already. Hey, look here what I found. What is that? Is that 10? That is 10, yes. And native copper. All here together to grace me with its presence. I don't mind if I do. And yes, more 10. I think we have found an abundance of 10. Awesome. This is this is this is the whole reason you kind of look around in the area that you found it. So didn't have the ability of digging in in that one spot, so I just marked it and then now come a little ways down and got several or low. Oh, I fell off the edge. Yeah, you can you can mine kind of. A, I mean, it, it, you look like you're a little short, dude, but apparently you got really long arms, and it's a good thing to kind of break stones. See there, ten ore hiding in behind that rock. So much tin ore. I think I saw, yep, another copper. Take a few in here. See any more sign? We're gonna want to try to get a prospecting fix here soon. That's why I want to get quite a bit of this tin. So that's a medium. They see that 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 place that I got it from that was poor. Now we're in a medium that gives us ten units per piece. That's basically two chunks, and this one's only going to give us one chunk. So this is this is richer ore, and that's what you're looking for, the richer ore. You know, it it does create a little bit of a grind, but trust me, once you get into the higher techs and higher levels and get yourself some armor made which I mean I could make some cheap armor but it's it's basically useless uh, we need flax to make some good armor and there's one of my mods we have an upcoming temporal storm we're not ready for that so I will do what I usually do early game that's why I put the Sleeping during Temple Storm in place is because I think they just come at a point where you're like, uh, I have no way to fight that off. And instead of just repeatedly dying, it's best to just sleep. And then, I mean, it just, I do that because. I'm not going to sit there and waste resources trying to fight them, which is kind of dumb in my, 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 my eyes. I mean, you can't defend yourself. You can't defend yourself against them. So why bother? I didn't mean to do that. 
bushes. Um, even bushes. Probably got like ten, uh, seven or eight back at the base. But but one of the things I want to do, since I've explored up here, oh my gosh, I kind of forgot about the gigantic hole that's right there. Oh, and right here. Let's make a spot here on the map. Hello. I'm trying to move the map. It's not letting me. Oh, there it is. Call it mud or see one mud. Okay, come on. But not gonna pin it. I'm gonna color it. That color. Uh, put this little. To me, that looks like a radio or like a ladder with a hole in it. Yeah, it's actually a ladder with a hole. And say, that's basically, that's my symbol for a little out of the way little bases. And since we have had luck in this area finding. Ten. Just gonna poke around in this little hole here. Maybe we'll get lucky, find something. Something. Pardon me. Huh? Doesn't look like we found anything there. I don't. I don't waste too much of my durability on my pick. All right, back south. Oh. Raccoons. Must be a bunch of berry bushes around. I am not worried about the raccoon right now. Let's see here. Let me figure this out. Oh yeah, we've got we've got plenty to put with our bushes. I mean, plenty to. Uh, I was. Harvested the bush, and I'm sitting here got bush on my head. Um, we have enough tin to alloy with our copper. We even got some copper. Medium. I don't understand why those two aren't going together. Oh, one's from granite. The other one's from claystone. Yeah, that's that's another thing when you yeah, okay. That right there is kind of annoying. You mine in a place that has a layer of two different um strata types, you're going to get that separation. And that's going to pay attention to what it says. This one's for, four is from granite. These two are from claystone. So, if you ever have that situation, you know, and the medium and poor chunks won't mix. So your inventory can get clogged up like this. And that's a little annoying, but I mean, it's just the game. Uh, it's how each piece of ore exists in the world. So, yeah. Please be no bear. Please be no bear. I'm tired of having to fight things when I get back exploring. No wolves, no bears, please. So far, so good. I don't hear no bear roaring in the background. All right. And let's see here. Let's put berries away and apparently something rotted I have no idea what rotted that 
was weird. Okay. And the, the, uh, whatever it was, the berries that were in that. I'm trying to figure, if I remember, oh, there it is. That's where I'm putting the rot. Oh, and that's also where I'm putting the bushes. Yeah, 19. And we don't have, we have a blueberry bush. Really, one blueberry bush. Hmm. The rot is important. We can make compost with rot. That's why I'm saving it. So, got to com uh, compost. Okay, bed. Got to put my bed back down. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah, the ore. Oh, there's more berries in my inventory. Why didn't those go together? Fresh 22 days. Fresh for one and a half days. If I put them together. Yeah, there we go. Those freshness. I... I, it's weird, uh, yeah, four, we need the hammer, we need that, uh, take the hammer, see, We've got two bits, this one is going to get Give us double. Look at that. 38. Do not make a 10 ingot. 10 ingots are not useful. Don't mess up like I did and think, oh, I'm just going to make all my 10 ingots. You're not going to be able, be able to do anything with 10 ingots. 10, 10 is, is an alloy mixture with something. You're not going to make anything with with it seriously it's funny that I got lead ore right here that's kind of why I don't want lead is because lead is everywhere I mean it's everywhere okay this is another mod uh oh, it's all the way over there uh alloy alloying uh, mod, uh, something about uh, alloys, calculator, alloy calculator, I think it is. Um, you hit Q to bring it up. You type in the units you want. I want 100 units of bronze. Not that. I want 10 bronze. Make sure you got this selected. Nothing will show up here. No matter if you click that, it's going to be... Uh, Basically, nothing. 100 units. That's enough to make a pickaxe. Alright. 18 and 20. And 2. Now, let's see. Can we do a 200? 36 and 4. Now, do we have other copper? Oh, shut up. Not that one. This one. Oh yeah, we got plenty. Oh, we got we got more than enough. Yes, we can make a bunch of things now. But I'm gonna have to make some molds. So, yeah. Huh. Well, it looks like we're gonna do some mold making because. Yeah, um, let's do this. Let's say 400. And I don't, it's alphabetical. 10 bronze, 72 and 8. But we can go, I want 12% 10 and 88% copper. 
because I want to use more tin than copper. I want to save them my copper. See how that changed? 10 and 70. So if you go back up to this 50-50, or, you know, basically, look at that, 72. You save 10 units or 2 units of copper. Yeah, two units of copper. Uh, 500. Six hundred. One oh six and fourteen. There's a reason I, I'm I'm trying to determine if I can make a pickaxe hammer well no we got a copper hammer a pickaxe a prospecting pickaxe a scythe a weapon something that's more powerful than these stupid spears and some saws we get some saws i can start making planks and that is awesome and so I'm really getting at the end. Uh, it's been about 30 minutes, been recording. Um, I'll probably cut out some of this anyway. Uh, and all that, we're fixed to have a temporal storm. And uh, we're not ready for that yet. So on the next episode, that's what I'm going to do. We will... Um, I'll, I'll get past this temporal storm and and uh, we'll make some molds, fire them in our fire pits. We are relatively safe right now with the, the fences around. Um, hopefully, and we will. Uh, I'm, I did this because I showed up here. And there were literally wolves out here. I want to be able to come outside. And if there's any bad things happening, I want to be able to build up something and fight it off. And there's the temporal storm. All right. Well. I'm going to say see you later. And, uh. Hope everybody has a good day. Uh, Happy New Year 2024. Uh, so, see you when the next episode comes around. Because I ain't messing with this. Because they'll whoop my butt. <laughs> Later.